I was right. It's just gonna be bigger than I even imagined. You ready? Ready. Wow, the reality really crashing out. I'm so sick and tired of helping people, bro. All I done ever did was help people, nigga. But y'all, they disrespecting his friend. I'm gonna start with Kara, right? Because right now I'm on some fuck everybody type shit. Nah, uh, the audio on demon time. Yeah. Nigga, fuck it with me. Nah, uh, uh, the entering his villain art. Uh, nigga, all I ever did was help Kara, nigga, Kara. If you wanna tell this shit, tell the whole story. Go ahead, tell people how you verbally abuse people, all right? Don't get on here and make it seem like niggas kicked you out. Like niggas kicked you out cause, uh, bullying you? Bro, go ahead and tell people how you talk to people. How you tell my security guy, oh, you home, oh, you work for me. Oh, uh, we are, uh, we, you ain't got no, you're poor. And, uh, we above you and how you, you talk to people like they nothing. You talk to people like they're, like they small, like they, like they beneath. She was talking to the employees crazy. You're homeless. If you tell people how you verbally abuse people, how you told me you're gonna spit on me when you see me, tell people how you. I'm gonna spit on you when I see you? Nah. That's the. Nah, how you gonna tell your boss I'm gonna spit on you when I see you? Nah. Nah, she was. Nah. She was talking too saucy. Talk to people, bro. Yeah, you, how, how you, how you, your brain is clinically imbalanced, bro. How you disrespect people. How you, how you go around treating people in your everyday life. I've been letting you do this whole thing where you act like you like a pre how you Talk to people, bro. Yeah, you, how, how you, how you, your brain is clinically imbalanced, bro. How you disrespect people. How you, how you go around treating people in your everyday life i've been letting you do this whole thing where you act like you like a princess and you sweet and you know like oh you just such a good girl bro stop the front bro we didn't internally we have withheld your actions since the beginning of me giving you this career what are we talking about bro what the fuck are we even talking about bro you don't even do nothing Ooh. you what the fuck? Mm. Yo, bro. It's so crazy to me, bro. Cause I fucking I I I've given you a career. And time and time you just disrespect me. I wrote every fucking verse you've done. I, I dressed you. I dressed all five of y'all niggas, bro. No. Done. I, I You wrote every verse. Dressed I dressed all five of y'all niggas, bro. I dress five niggas every- Oh, oh, nah, nah, he talking like he- Nah, he talking a little crazy. He talking like he they pop. He said, I dressed all five of y'all every morning, every day. The boxers, the pants. Nah, he talking a little crazy. Every time we stepped out the house, I put an outfit on every- What your verses? I put all your outfits together. I lay your clothes out for the everybody. morning. Nah. Eight carat earrings and everybody ear. I put three chains on all your neck. We Cartier watch. I gave you that chrome Rolex. Bro, you the most dis you you was watching tables. You no. Nah, he said before I got to you, you was busting tables and cleaning them and stuff. Nah. You was you was you was you was waiting. No. What are we talking about? No. What about, nigga? your motherfucking life and you on here lying talking about some we bully you that shit got me fucked up bro you got me fucked up bro you disrespectful bro you talk to people crazy you tell people that they are nothing you tell people you're gonna spin them you you tell people they poor and you talk to the you talk to my fucking label crazy you claim i was stealing money from you bro stealing money from you how nigga stealing money from you how bro you ain't made no money bro See, this is the problem with you new artists. Y'all fucking, y'all get popping online, and then you become more popular than your actual music, right? You nine hundred thousand dollars in a hole, and I got every fucking receipt. Nine hundred thousand? How you not? How you get nine hundred thousand in debt? See, nigga, nine hundred thousand dollars in a hole. I got every fucking receipt, nigga, and I'ma post it. Hey, you try me, try me, I'ma post it, nigga. 
and I'll post how much money your fucking streams are made. You got, bro, stop, don't, don't go on the internet and act like I'm bullying you, bro. I've been nothing but loving and caring and paid your bills and gave you money and, and, and took you around the world. And nobody would even know who the fuck Caribou was if it wasn't for me. What are we talking about, bro? What the fuck are we talking about, bro? I wrote that fucking verse when we went on On The Radar. I put you last on purpose so everyone would say, who the fuck is that girl? I the beat down. I put 808 specifically on your Whoa. verse. So when it got to your part and the beat dropped, everyone would be like, oh, the, the girl is the craziest one. I wrote that verse the next No, Lil Yachty really made Caribou. That's exactly what I thought when I, when I, um... When I listened to it the first time, I was like, dang, this girl is the craziest verse. No. Yachty's a smart man. I'm like, nah. He really, nah. The night before we even went to on the radar, on my phone, bro, I typed, I, I, I got the voice, I got the fucking reference. No. What the fuck are we talking about? You ain't never, you ain't never wrote, no, no, a song in your life. That's why ain't no music came out since you've been left. Because you ain't got no music. Because you can't rap. What are we talking about? And I wasn't going to say nothing. On my mother's life, I was going to let you go live. Now, what made Lil Yachty get on this timing right here? Live your life and go get a new writer and go get a stylist and go. Do now, he really disrespect. Now, he really not. Nah, he really disrespect. You, I wasn't going to speak on you, but you're going to go on the internet and say that I'll bully you. Kara, I have never bullied you. I let you live in my house for free. You lived in my house for free when you didn't have nowhere to live. I let you live in my house. I let you live in my house for free. I let you live in my house for motherfucking free when you was disrespecting my home security and telling them that they they beneath you and that they better shut the fuck up and watch this house because they work for you when they work for me. Now, who she talk now? Why she was talking so crazy? Same way you talk to people at the label, same way you talk to that shut up and watch the house. Shut nah, up he had to kick her out. To the torn person. All right, let me look at this reference track before I get bitch. Make a lot of real music. The next stop. Yachty just made this whole song. Yachty couldn't release this song himself. That I trust to knock off the dust. Walk with that sack under my arm, cause stacking up a must. Basically, what I'm trying to say here is I'm not gonna let y'all fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not fucking with none of y'all. Like, I'm trying to get some. She's not even heard lyrics, and she's not. Nah, she really just sitting up here explaining them. Like, she wrote these lyrics, it came out of her, her brain, her head money i don't need no nigga y'all be in the way walk with that sack under my arm because stacking up must i walk with the sack under my arm because i get money and um stacking up is a must did i lie must underarm nah she came up with this for the fly he's not even her lyrics he just nah she really just sat up here and lied to our face my Dude. Both like, literally like, came to us was like, we about to do going on the radar, radar, let's just do it. Make sure everybody have y'all verse, figure it out. Yeah, so we start, stay in this room. Yeah, You're not leaving start, until we, you get it right. Karen didn't even do her shit that day. Her verse was I tried rich. it too many times. She like, probably made like eight she, verses. Yeah, I couldn't get it right. <laughs> it's too much pressure to be at the end. So I literally did it like the day of. Like, when she the, came to on the radar, that was wow. our first time. Here. <laughs> yeah. like, Stacking up a must. Basically, what I'm trying to say here is 
I'm not gonna let y'all fuck. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not fucking with none of y'all. Like, I'm trying to get some money. I don't need no nigga. Y'all be in the way. Walk with that sack. Nah, that's crazy. And she really just sat up here and explained it like it, it was her lyrics. Nah. She sat up here explaining it like it was her lyrics. Arm cause stacking up must. I walk with the sack under my arm because I get money. And um stacking up is a must. Did I lie? Must, underarm, must. It's like a known thing. People be musty. Not me though. I crush the perk into the tuss, to get up the fuss. Move like a boss. I'm not like them. They doing such and such. Nah, this is crazy. How do I move like a boss? I just know what I want and I do whatever I need to do to get it. And I figure shit out and I stay on business. I don't need nobody to She's not on her lyrics, and she's just explaining them. That's crazy. <laughs> nah, that's crazy. Dude, so like, yeah, it was. That was, that was awesome. <laughs> nah, why, nah, why Gio smile like that? Nah, she she already knew. She already knew she ain't right to burst. Oh, that was a Gio real... the only one that knew. Reaction from us. We, like, we, like, <laughs> we were at on the radar <laughs> waiting for <laughs> her to come back. Like, to we know the, the 808s come in. That's it. Just, man, it you know, nigga, that I trust. <laughs> like, like, wait, 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 wait. Nah, that's crazy. Right. Switch the beat up. We didn't even know the beat how to switch. You said, damn. Nobody even remembered what the fuck we said. Nah, you like, you know, you know you ain't write you know you ain't write your verse. You know you ain't write your verse. Posting this to play dang. The reference track Mel and coffin for her. <laughs> She really snaked the Yachty. You can't read an out of her seat. Dang. Oh, we can go there. Let's see what it is. Nah, these are some freaky bars, Mel Yachty. Bro. Like, these are like some pause. Pause bars. Like, dang. Congratulations to the first artist that could have been, man. I told y'all I was gonna do this to this bitch ass nigga, man. This, this fuck nigga ain't had nothing. This nah, fuck. They say, nah, they say this how Yachty was. Nigga was broke. How ass nigga was broke, man. Congrats. Nah. Yachty said she was a waitress before. Oh, bro, you gonna sit up here and act like. Oh, I done done. I put this nigga onto the podcast. Wait, yeah, this the Mitch thing. So his best friend, Mitch. He done crashed out on him. I don't know. Nah, y'all be really in his villain arc. He really crashing out. He not taking no more disrespect. So Yadi's best friend Mitch, ex girlfriend, tried exposing him or something. Let's see. The fuck you, cause that podcast wouldn't be shit without him. Don't nobody watch that shit for your mush. Delusional girlfriend. The, the, the delusional girlfriend. <laughs> what is she talking about? <laughs> The whole reason the podcast is because of Lil Yachty. I'm not like nobody really knew who Mitch was until Lil Yachty. Mouth having ass. Nobody watched that shit for you, nigga. People watch that shit for him. And let's really get into the team. People really watch that shit because of me. Nobody know who you are, buddy. Nobody knows you. They don't watch it for you. This is my first time hearing about this girl. Don't even know her name. The Safe Place Podcast. Yeah. Nobody knows her. Delusional. You want to make it about her? Because you're the one that brought up the fact that I was just the, the cousin shit. You fucking brought that shit up because you wanted to try to fucking clown and humiliate that fucking nigga. And yeah, that shit is about fucking me, nigga. So who's real? So who's really giving? The cousin that she. Oh, he did sleep with his cousin. I didn't see that on the podcast. Wow. That's a little crazy. You the clown that's a little for that wild podcast. Me, nigga. Because that's the running joke on y'all shit. The fuck? All right. <laughs> Who she thinks she is? Who she thinks she is? She thinks she's the star of the podcast. <laughs> so was dating his cousin once. You really are from cousin. Alabama, nigga. No, no, no. He dated his yo. Cousin. Yeah, explain, uh, me, explain the story. You think I just like yo? You're my cousin. Let's date. It oh, wasn't like that. Oh, they didn't that. know they were cousins. It wasn't like that, bro. She, I, we was chilling in the room, and then she said something. Like she always said, "Oh, well, y'all got the rainbow nail." And little thing is, I'm like, and then she said, "Man, my 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 uncle last name is." I'm like, "Your uncle last name." What? And then we go on Facebook, mutual friend, auntie. And I'm like, oh, they fucked several oh. times, too many times. Nah, that's like a nah, that's crazy. Uh, and they didn't stop fucking after. They Yo, oh, no, that's that's bad. Cause he ain't know at first, and after he found out, nah, that's bad. Oh!
Okay, now listen. listen you weird. Now, did I strike afterwards? That's a little. Well, he said, did I strike? Nah. Yes, was that my <laughs> right mind? No. Nah, he was striking and he already knew. He was striking and he knew too. Nah, it must have been good. He must have. It must be. You know what I'm saying? Good. I need. I can admit, like I, I need help. You know what I'm saying? I got. You know what I'm saying? I, I mean, we, are not perfect. It was a one-time thing, and I, and I told Bart about that. In one-time thing. He said he striked multiple times after. Confidence and like, what are you doing? So was dating his cousin once. You really are from once. Alabama, no, nigga. Everyone listening to the Kai said I saved his episode. You need to leave. Need to leave. Oh my Jeez. god! Bitch, bitch, you dumb bride. This nigga was telling you lies just to get away from you, ho. What is you oh. talking about, ho? Nigga, talking about all the times you called him, he was in meetings. Me, she ain't never did no damn meetings for me, nigga. Fuck is you talk about, nigga? Nigga, with me, me, bro, me, bro, stop, stop playing with me, ho. You wasn't, you're not even a factor in this, bro. You was really a bitch that he just used to use to sleep at your motherfucking house, ho. I ain't never stole a dollar from this nigga. Mitch, Mitch been living with me since the motherfucking 10 years ago, nigga. When I ain't even have a, a cent, nigga. When I lived in my mama's house, he lived with me, nigga. How did you talking about, ho? You, you, you really starting some shit you don't know what you talking about. You not even a... You don't know nothing you talking about, ho. What, is you, what are you saying, bro? I ain't never stole a dollar from that nigga. If anything, I helped him nigga out. I, da I dare you. Mitch, you better get this, ho, bro. You better get you better get this whole bro. If I really like really tell it how it is, bro. Nigga ain't never did nothing for me. Fuck is you talking about, ho? Nigga, you dumbass broad. Hold on. Uh, why did Mitch cousin even bring herself into this? Like nobody really like she didn't really have to involve herself into this because she wasn't really a part of it. She didn't really have to involve herself into this. Bitch. All right, this the came to me. And for many years, you didn't just start making beats, by the way. You've been making beats since who knows how long you've been making beats. What I'm telling you is it's shit you can tell. What? Even, what? If, even if, even if, what I'm telling you. Think about yourself, listen, though. But no, no, listen, no. Even if then, say, that's what I, that's the point I'm trying to make to you, bro. Nah, like, he like don't know what to do. Everybody been in this situation before. Or two people arguing, you just don't know what to do. What point? Even if then, if I wasn't doing shit right, to you like just there. Just then, older now, so I would not tell it to do yeah, anything like I was doing back yeah, then, yeah, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But that's what I'm trying to tell that's you. That's fine, but you—that's because you've been through, you've been through years of 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 development. Bro, think, think about. Remove me from this situation. Remove me. I was never in your life. What the fuck would you have been doing? Who I feel like you might have been doing that shit. Who knows what you would have been doing if you ain't if if you ain't have a to show you. What are you saying, bro? I'm saying that what you're saying is not. It's not. You're not. You're not like it's not true. You wouldn't tell him. Hey man, just go get a job, man. No, you I ain't saying. Thing? I ain't saying no. That's not what I said. I ain't so saying I would tell a nigga to go get a job. I ain't say that. I said I would. Somebody ever. Oh, bro, Juicy? we got Desi Banks. Oh. Okay. Juice. Oh, First person to spark up in the room. Alright. Alright, the Mitch. Mitch class crash out. I'm talking about some little yachty bully. Dylan Dennis. Why is Dylan Dennis in here? Feel bad. He crying. It's uh, disrespecting his friend in front of Key Glock. Okay, that's bro. I didn't, I didn't, that, I, bro. Mitch came to me like, I need to do something in life. Help me out. I said, all right, you know what? I'm going to give you a platform. I'm going to find someone to sponsor us, and I'm going to give you a platform. We're going to make a podcast, and I'm going I'm to show people how funny you are. I'm going to show people how crazy you are. I'm going to show people, like, how cool you are. And it's going to give you... A platform. You know what I'm saying? I ain't wanna do no motherfucking podcast, nigga. I'm a motherfucking rapper, nigga. Nah. Got millions of dollars. I don't need to talk to other rappers. What the fuck are we talking about? I did the podcast for Mitch. 
Don't put goddamn three, 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 four hundred thousand dollars in Mitch's pocket. And y'all sitting here talking about something. He disrespecting his friend. And I got, I'm, I fuck, fuck, I ain't fucking with Mitch, bro. I talk, I, I been asleep all day. I wake up to this crazy shit. Mitch, how the, I say, Mitch, how the fuck you didn't go on the internet and tell these folks that we playing, bro? That tweet got goddamn six million views on it. Why the fuck you ain't going there telling folks we playing? Man, it's Twitter, bro. You know how that is, bro. You know how Twitter is, bro. You know how Twitter is, bro. All right, fuck that then, nigga. Fuck the podcast, nigga. Fuck you. Fuck you, nigga. Fuck you. Nah, I was just in that. Nah. This caribou fault. Go, go, um, let me go to Mitch profile because he has some tweets. What's his profile? I just I saved it. All right, Madman Mitch. Whew. All right. That has the mindset that she knows she's bad. All right, let's clear some things up. Please don't let that clean this out of you. Too much. But respect. Blah, 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 blah. I ain't no. Oh, this one, he started crashing out. I ain't nobody, little bro. Never been. Check my history. I got stats before I met, bro. I got even more now. All I ever wanted to do was just focus on the music and being involved in the culture in a positive way. Hope none of this hindered or that. <clears throat> you don't hear it from me. It's not true. Bro, never stole. Me and we don't have no shady history or anything along that nature, so that's crap. Everybody just know me, know I put in work. Nobody can take that from me. And he wasn't trying to take that from me. We just did it on camera. If it got taken out of context, I'm dead. The next podcast will be epic. I don't even think we do that. Yes, this time we are around. Insert hint to below. Yo, man, <laughs> yo, man, cat. So he he doesn't know. The first step is denial, my boy. Dang, is the podcast really over? Mitch don't know. Dang, there won't be no podcast next week. <laughs> Dang. There won't be no podcast. Dang, he might have to 